how to make $300 a day with CPA content locking. Stay tuned. What's up you guys, it's your boy Jeremy Cash back with another valuable, valuable video for you. Today I'm gonna show you exactly how you can content lock certain things like movies, you know, uh, TV shows, trainings, anything that you want to, and I'm gonna show you exactly how you can get paid from it. It's really simple, so let's dive right into it. Okay, so right now we're on, you know, this movie that I'm gonna show you exactly how to lock. Uh, this movie recently came out probably a few days ago, maybe a week or so ago, uh, What Men Want with Taraji P. Henson, very popular movie, a lot of people are talking about it. So I wanna show you guys how you can lock this. Um, I found this movie on another site, um, one of the sites that I told you guys about before that you can find free movies on. And so I'm gonna show you exactly how to lock that, right? So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to you know the website, which is uh, www1, dot one two three movies dot la all right uh it's kind of a lot they got a bunch of different one two three movie websites so uh once you go there you can find a couple of different movies um and then you'll get to the movie and the movie looks like this so this is the entire movie i already watched it yesterday with my wife so it is the full movie um and so what you do is once you you know i'll click on it show you that it plays all right, and then you see this arrow right here. You click on this arrow, and it'll bring you to a page that looks just like this, right? First thing you want to do is click download, open load, right? This one right here. So you'll click on that, and then it'll bring you to a page that looks like this with the movie. Now, these things does have a lot of pop-ups sometimes, so you have to click exit out these pop-ups. Uh, don't worry about these pictures down here. These are just those native ads I told you guys about before that people try to get paid from. You want to come down here to embed it, okay? And you just click this embedded code. You can copy this. And I'll have to exit out some of this stuff because they do have a lot of pop-ups, so beware of the pop-ups. All right, I'll take this code and then I'll go over to my website creator, which is leadpages.net now this what this website creator guys is around $37 a month if you have it you can use it it's it's amazing for this kind of stuff if you don't you can always use Weebly and Wix they should work exactly the same okay so I'm just gonna go to one of my test pages that I usually test all my lockers on that I don't really use I just kind of use it to test things out before I start so I already did this so I'll delete that I'll come over here to show you how easy this is I'll come over here to my page layout. Oh wait, let me come up. I'll come over here to my widgets and then I'll scroll down to HTML, okay? So I'll grab the HTML because that's what you need for your video and I'll paste it there, okay? Then I'll click on it, a box will show up here at the bottom and then I will just paste what I just copied. I will paste it right there and then I will click on save. And this will load that, that video that you guys see uh, on this page here. It will load this video up. This one. <laughs> okay, so after that, then I go to CPA Grip, right? Uh, as you can see, I haven't made any money today. I haven't really promoted this since the last couple of videos, but these are just example videos. Um, and so what I'll do is I'll go to your monetization tools, click on Content Lockers, you want to create a new locker, okay? You click I agree. Page looks like this. Click I agree. Go to continue. Now we're here, okay? This is where you guys are going to set up your locker. Now, depending on what social media platform you are on, most of the time I'll probably promote this on like Facebook. So what I'll do is I'll go over here to templates. Come down here to this one. This is kind of like my Facebook template, as you guys can see. And some of you already know this method because I've done it before, but just for, you know, clarification so you guys can understand, I can type in Facebook human verification. Okay, and so this is usually one of the tricks that usually gets people to, oh, okay, in order for me to watch it, you know, I'll have to go through this verification process. 
And so we can put that in the middle or we can leave it over there. I think I kind of like it over there. All right. And so if you want to, you could put some more words here, but I haven't figured out how to make these smaller yet. Not on this uh, actual platform since I'm on this template. I can't make, I can't change these words right here because I chose a template. But if you did the general way, you could actually change those words. So just for this, I'll do Facebook human verification. Okay. And then, um, the tease time. So we'll come down here to the tease time right here. And what the tease time means is how long do you want them to be able to watch the, the, the movie before this pops up in order for them to continue the movie. So if you don't want any seconds, if you want them to click on the, the movie site and it pops up as soon as they click on it, you keep it at zero. But if you want it to, uh, them to be able to click on the movie and watch around 10 to 15 seconds of it, then, then pop up, then you can go to about 10 seconds. So we'll say 10 seconds on that when it loads. Okay. And I'll just come back up here and I'll say to watch is that what men want. I'll just go ahead and put that. Okay. And then if you want to do your own little wait, I usually do something crazy. Sometimes you can put an emoji, but I'll usually do something like this right here. Okay. A couple of emojis, change the color of it if you want to just sort of stand out, right? So we could change that to red if we want to, or however you want to. I'm just giving you guys an example, sort of stand out. But uh, after that, guys, you pretty much, that's pretty much all you need to do. You don't need to click on one click. You just keep all that the same. You can, they can access this for, you know, 24 hours. Now right here, you want them to be able to keep scrolling. So what that means is once you click this box, they'll still be able to keep scrolling on the movie website, but they won't be able to access what's behind it, which will be the movie, right? If you click no scrolling, they can't scroll. So they'll be able to see that the movie is actually still playing because they clicked on it, but they had in order to finish watching it, they'll have to do this, okay? So then uh, style, when you come here, you don't have to worry about any of this stuff. When you go to mobile, you don't have to worry about any of this stuff. It just kind of shows you what it looks like. Uh, advance, you don't have to worry about anything like that. Well, now on this unlock, um, the unlock action, you go to redirect URL and then paste the URL of the website that you're on, that they can be on to watch the movie, okay? Which is gonna be the website that you added your video to. So you'll paste that URL link right here and then you can click create. For now, I'm not gonna do that right now, but I'll just say does nothing and then I'll come back here and click create, right? So once I click create, my locker is ready. I would simply click get code, which is right here at the top, since this is the one I made. I would come here, I would copy this, right? And then I could close that out. Now I would come back to my lead pages or your Weebly or your Wix, okay? I would go back to my HTML the same HTML, then I would press enter so I can space these two out and I would paste that right here. I would click save, right? So after that, I think you're good to go. You should be able to preview it. So I'll preview to see how long. So once this pops up, you guys will be able to see the movies right there. They'll cl they can click it. They'll be able to start watching it. Wait, uh, excuse that. That's those, those, those ads I'll be talking about. See, they click it, they're able to start watching it. These are ads that pops up in the background before the movie starts. And then they can't click off of it. So they can still scroll in the background and the movie will still be playing, but in order for them to uh, continue watching the movie, they would have to fill out one of these offers. Okay, so the movie is starting right now in the background. So if that time is not long enough, so this is what we'll do. Let me exit this preview. And like I said, these ad, these pop-ups are crazy, guys. It's a lot of like freaking cartoon porn, basically. So you gotta click off of that stuff like really quick. Cause it's, some of it is just, just downright, people are sick. But uh, let's see. So after that, you'll go back to your CPA grip. You can click on uh, get code again. Well, not get code, but you'll click on edit and we'll change the tease time because I think that was pretty fast. I'll change it to like 20 seconds. So give them at least 20 seconds for the movie to come on. 
Okay, so we'll save that. And I think it should be good now. So let me go back here and let me go back to preview. Cause I think, you know, 20 seconds is good enough. Give them enough time to kind of click on the movie, be able to watch it. As you guys see, these ads are, are nuts. So it, as you can see, it's just a bunch of crazy ads. You gotta click off this stuff, unfortunately. So excuse these. And then it pops up, okay? So you can have it tease as long as it wants before the movie comes on, but they will have to go through the ad first, unfortunately which sucks, but um, let me show you guys something else that you can do, okay? If, once you have that, if you actually wanna make your own landing page with this to add on to this, you could actually, you know, add a photo, okay? So you would simply add, let me come right here. Let's say you wanted to add the cover photo of the movie. So let's go to Google right quick. And then let's say what men want, right? Let's go to images and let's go to, yeah, you can, so you can, let's say you wanted to save this image right here and then you wanted to go ahead and add that at the top for your landing page right so we'll go to upload we'll find what men want picture we'll click that we'll save it we'll click insert and now that's at the top so now when we preview just to give you guys a rundown okay forget all this stuff this is just a practice page but you'll have your you know your stuff here you have your video here that they can actually watch the movie and then the content locker will pop up in about 20 seconds. So they'll click it, they'll be watching the movie or the ad, getting the ads out the way, and then your content locker will pop up, okay? So, like I said, they'll still be able to scroll. I didn't wanna click on the video because all these pop-ups are gonna be popping up, but they'll still be able to actually watch the movie and things like that, guys. So uh, that's something you can do, and that's kinda how you can do any uh, website that you are wanting to do and hopefully this video helped you. Uh, if you guys have any questions, like I said, excuse those images that were on there. That's, that's, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about when you try to do this. Those, when you click on the video, uh, you'll get a bunch of pop-ups, so you gotta hurry up and click out of those. But uh, if you guys haven't even seen the movie, you might wanna check it out, it's a pretty cool movie. Uh, but other than that, that's how you lock pretty much any type of content. Uh, hopefully I didn't confuse you. If I did, just let me know and I'll make another video, but I will be making more videos on content locking as well. Um, like the video, you know, if it helped. If you got any questions, comment below. And hopefully you guys make some money with this and I will see you guys later. Peace.